Just want to make a quick video answering some questions that you all had about live ops. So thank you for subscribing. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. So let's get into it. So one of the questions that was asked was what type of USB headset do I use? Um, I just use the going one is Logitech. You could use Logitech. But whatever you can afford, remember y'all, get whatever you can get in the beginning. Don't invest a whole lot of money into it because you may not like working from home, okay? This may not be your cup of tea, right? So get a cheap headset. Look into that description um, down below where they offer work from home equipment. So check them out, okay? Um, someone asked also, um, if, is it possible to use air earbuds, I'm sorry, with built-in mic? So I'm not quite sure how would you do that. A USB, um, um, USB headset is the one they recommend. So I would just, you know, scratch the AirPods out unless you did working with a different type of work for home um, company. So just check with them first, okay? But the ones that I've told you all about require a USB headset, okay? Um, someone asked what client, I guess, with LiveOps was I providing services for? Right now, I'm providing services for assurance and direct response. Had training with them today. It was absolutely fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Let's see here. Um, yes, so go and apply for I Dow You. It's a very beginner-friendly work-from-home um, company to start with. I Dow You. Go apply with them. Once you apply with them, drop down in the comments that you apply, and I reach out to the recruiter and let them know to be on the lookout for um for your um your name and everything you have to create a escape account next question is shift smart now yes i um i signed up for shift smart about i say maybe a year or two ago for the um call center um position where you worked and you got paid within 24 to 48 hours well lately um they haven't had any positions available but i did mention that because it was in my area Shift Smart mainly goes off area. So if you're in the area, <clears throat> just check them out. Shift Smart. It's an app that you do on your phone. You spend everything on your phone and you can get paid between 24 to 48 hours. So Shift Smart is a fantastic company to work for. They have mystery well not mystery shop. Let me let me back up. They have um positions where like you can go to different um convenience stores and, and do restock. Um so sometimes you see people in particular um service station i think is circle k and they're not in the regular um circle k uniform like you see the people the cashiers that means a lot of times they hire with out outsource they're outsourced and a lot of times they with they're hired through shift smart shifts i'm sorry shifts <coughs> shift smart i do apologize y'all i'm dealing with a lot of nasal drain but i want to get this video out here because i have a lot of a lot of questions, so I just want to get here out, out here quick as I can. Um, so also I made a video about Playtest Cloud. Someone in the comments said that um, it's definitely worth it, and they made over a thousand dollars. They've made over thousands over the years. So Playtest Cloud is a wonderful company to start with. Like I said, it's, a, it's you download an app onto your phone, and all you're doing is playing games. Now, if you're the type of person that like to play games on your on your cell phone, this would be a fantastic way to make money. Why not play those games and get paid for them? Like I'm not talking about like PlayStation. All that kind of, I'm like, look, app. I ain't gonna say little, but mobile. Phone, I mean, mobile, mobile um, app phones that you um, games you play on your mobile phone. Uh, let me see here. Uh, let's see. There are no startup. Someone asked about startup fees for um, live ops. There are no startup fees. Only thing you have to do is pay for your background check. That's it. So if you think you have some things on your background check that you think will prevent you from working, don't apply. Just keep following me for more um, work from home jobs that don't require you to submit a background check. Uh, let me see. Someone asked for the link to purchase the computers. I put that um, down in the description down below. Click on that link. It's family-owned company. They supply all the work for home equipment for a RISE platform, for LiveOps platform, for every work for home platform. They, they supply all your um, equipment, even for mobile notaries. If you need a printer, scanner, look on look on that website and um, 
laptops if you're looking for a laptop look on this check out that link down below they, they have um, laptops there too let's see I'm just going through on my other phone and don't forget to like comment subscribe y'all I'm just trying to get this video out y'all I've been working extremely hard live ops has given um, a center this week so I've been just trying to plug in plus getting assignments for my notary business like it's really it's really been taking off for me so Thank you all for bearing with me, being a little bit, sound like a little bit all over the place. And my subscriber count is going up, so I'm very thankful, y'all. Thank you for trusting in me, for sharing this information with you all. Um, so someone asked for the hours for operation for I Dow You. At the time when we were calling, we was calling from 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. for I Dow You. Those not those aren't always the hours, but the time that's those were the hours. Okay. I always tell people if you want to do a work from home job, always make sure two things, y'all, for real. Two things. Make sure that you're available for that training, because sometimes the training is unpaid, sometimes the training is paid. Sometimes they're very strict about training. So if you can't commit to two weeks full eight hour training, ten hour training, don't even waste some people's time. Like for real, for real. Don't waste those people's time. Um. Let me see here. Someone asked how much someone can make doing um, loan side. I think I made a video about that. Um, it's up to you how much you want to make doing loan. Do you want to go hard? Do you want to require a certain amount per loan closing? Do you want to go through signing services? I mean, it's it's up to you. It's up to you how much you want to make. I know it's a little bit all over the place, but I'm just trying to go through some questions. I didn't want to make a single video for each comment. Maybe I should. Y'all let me know um, what y'all think. Also, I wanted to ask y'all, did y'all want me to make a video about how to budget these work from home opportunities? Like, how do I keep all my money separated and how do I pay my bills for like DoorDash, um, GoPuff, LiveOps, my notary business? How do I keep, you know, how do I budget my money? I do reverse budgeting. Reverse budgeting is like, say your bills is $1,200. So, you know, you have to at least come up with $1,200. I'm just saying that's a low number, but just to say your bills are twelve hundred dollars, you know whatever you do have to accumulate to twelve hundred dollars. So that's how I do. So say I have a water bill due, the water bill due is, is seventy five dollars. So say the water bill is due, say the water bill is seventy five dollars and due tomorrow. That means I have to do everything in my power to make seventy five dollars today because the bill is due tomorrow. That's reverse budgeting. It may not sound that way to you all, but that's how I do it. That's how I've been able to not have a W two clock in job for. Maybe five, six years now. Yeah, for real. So I'm, I'm, I'm truly blessed that I figured this out. And I want you all to, to have the freedom and flexibility too, to, you know, live your dreams and be able to be with your children because they're not going to be young forever. And, and bear with my smoke detector going off. I know somebody commented um, a while ago about my smoke detector going off in one of my videos. Y'all, I know it's them hardwired smoke detectors, boy. It's a blessing. But when that battery start losing the thing, Oh my gosh. So that's where I'm going to wrap up today. I'll make some more um, content later about um, answering some comments that y'all all left down below. And like I said, please bear with me. I know I'm a little bit out all over the place, but I hope I answer your questions. And please don't stop asking me questions if you have questions about any of my videos. And I hope you all continue to have a fantastic day. Thank you.